Hi there guys, and welcome to another review. I'm going to be reviewing the Beachside Vacation Home, as well as the uh, LEGO City Race Boat, and the LEGO City Deep Sea Scuba Scooter, so I figured we got a three in one. This is my first LEGO review, may as well do three at once, just to kind of show them and how the city and the creator kind of intermingle really well together. Uh, first I'm going to start off with the Beachside Vacation House. I did build the uh, base set. Um, you can see it's it's a folding home that's a dock and got a little skidoo and turtle there. It does come with two other versions. Uh, one of them is a uh, more of like a small beachside hut with um, a motorboat. And then the other looks to be um, a beachside store as well as a little um, surfboard. Uh, boat there on the side. I figure what those are called. Anyway, so we'll start off with this. Uh, the two figures are really great. Um, nice beach weather clothing. Um, the girl has, you know, two sided face as much of the Lego figures do nowadays, and the guy has um, kind of a puffy face, as in one of them he's lifting weights. So he's going to have that face. And pretty good figures that it came with. Um, like I said, I did build this one, so it came with the Sea Dew. And uh, that looks, it's good pretty basic um, but it's it serves you get the idea it serves the purpose uh, and then I love this little turtle guy he's so cute uh, just like a cute little addition that they added on there that they didn't really need to um, I don't know what purpose these serve in the other uh, buildings but they don't look super important so it was just a nice touch Lego always does little nice things like that so let's get into the house uh, overall, I like this. It does unfold, as you can see, and then I'll just show you the interior. Um, looks, I, I still don't understand the purpose of this. I don't know if it's a coat rack or supposed to be like a like a propane heater or something like that. Um, but yeah, th that's in there. I threw the extra pieces up in the attic because you know that's what you do with them. There's the extra eye pieces, so it came with a few extra pieces, which was nice. I didn't have any missing pieces. Uh, quality control there is really good. I had then there's a fish tank, chair, and little moving fan which works. Uh, the the big window does open. I don't know if you can see. Um, here, the big window does open and close. Uh, the smaller windows up top and on the side do not. And obviously all the doors do open as well. So that works really well. And the chair swivels which is kind of nice. Oops, nope. Of course that happens when I'm trying to show. Um, but the chair does swivel, so you can have the person facing the uh, tank or inside of the house or the window, whatever you like. Uh, the ladder goes up, so I, I guess when the water comes in, it's not down there. Um, little seagull is cute, and then the little flag. Uh, let's go to the exterior of the house. Um, it comes with the, the uh, surfboard. I put two of the extra pegs down so that I can clip it onto the house. Uh, little tree is cute, and then the cot is nice. This is my only con on this one uh, Is I wish they came with two of these so that you could make the uh, the surfboard boat Because um, it's just a fishing rod so you could have two boats ideally uh, Or you could just not have the cot here, but I like the idea of the cot and then the the sea star star Yeah, sea star a uh, little bench the fishing rod, which is cute hanging off the side there. This is the other con. Um, I don't remember, I couldn't find any, but I, I know that LEGO used to make proper fishing rod pieces, and I wish that they would do that again. I mean, this is kind of like just the lance with um, a little peg to make it look like a fishing rod, but they had actual fishing rods. And I, if I can't remember if they had string or not, but I do remember that it was a, a d definitive piece, and I miss that. I wish that they'd go back to having that. Uh, the overhang is nice. Uh, the overall the overall feel of this I mean the glossy pieces it just makes it look very good uh, so that's that's the uh, beachside vacation house uh, I'll open it up so you can see get the whole feel for it they got the water and then the sand in the back which makes sense if it goes like this so you can see that this would be the beach and that's the water and the sand um, it also works like this too and that's fine and then we'll move on to the race boat uh, I wanted to show these for scale that the city and creator can work in conjunction with each other. Um, my The biggest drawback I find with a lot of the city ones is there aren't enough homes to make it feel like a city. Or if there are, they're so expensive. They're like the $100, $150 ones, nothing in like the $30 range. 
So this was nice for a summer side vacation kind of concept where you have your guys, you know, vacationing. Um, you have a race boat on the lake. Um, if you have like a blue square, you can have that. This one was was pretty cool. Engine moves, nothing, nothing really extraordinary. I think it was like a ten dollar set or something. Um, the guy in here wearing, wearing the uh, safety vest, and this is great for like starfighters or a wings and stuff like that if you want to do it. And uh, it does not float. Um, but it does look really cool on the ground. And then lastly, we have the scuba guy. This is the only one I thought would be dangerous if you were to have it for real, because if you come down here, you're gonna get cut by the blades. But um, yeah, he's there's an octopus. Um, once again, it's to scale with everything else. So you can see like the little sidu and this are about the same size, and that kind of works really well together. Um, the turtle and the octopus uh, would roughly, I'm assuming this is a large octopus, so that would that would work quite well. Um, yeah, it's a, it's a great sort of ocean vibe set together. Um, I think the uh, in Canada this one was like 6.99. I got there was a sale at a local Toys R Us, so I picked these up. This one was 6.99. Um, this one was 9.99. This one was uh, like thirty dollars. So for you know fifty bucks, you get three sets that work really well together and this this would be um, you know a lot more than what you'd get with a regular $50 set from Lego so all in all you know B plus A excellent it's Lego there's not a lot that's wrong with it um, like I said the fishing rod and then just some of the interior stuff I wish that if it came with an extension so you could make this part come out more but I'm gonna build like a little uh, brown base so that it, so you can put it um, 90 degrees and it feels like the interior of a home and you can actually put like a table and some chairs and have them sit down. Uh, all in all, pretty good. Uh, that's the uh, Lego Creator Beachside Vacation House uh, race boat and the scuba diver. Thanks for watching. Please do like and subscribe. Helps me out a lot. And if you like more, then stay tuned, subscribe, and watch future videos. Thank you. Have a good day.